Hello YouTube, it's Sarah again. Once again, I'm doing something that I didn't plan to do. It's getting late, and this is not what I'm supposed to do now. Following impulses. I came, came to YouTube only for the reason to be able to leave comments, rate and support first of all my sister and so on and so forth and I promised myself no matter what I would end up doing and I didn't even realize all the possibilities that lay before me I was just opening a channel for the fun of it and I promised myself not to, not to come to the point where small actions would get to me that I would just do what I felt like doing and stay focused. I managed to do that for a long time. I um, didn't expect anything. I didn't expect anything of myself other than making things and having fun and chatting with other people and sharing and all that jazz. But now I don't know. I've failed not only myself but my entire life. <laughs> well, you see, I'm in real life. I'm not a good friend. I've become this hermit. But friends I found on YouTube help me to stay happy and positive and I try to do the same and now I see that even though I get the amazing support from Jen and Susan from um, Alan from all all of you sadly I have to admit it's not enough in the way that I've come to the part where video word I brought up some issues that video got so much response more than I could ever hope for and I just wanted to get the word out I agree with every statement it's so wonderful when people put words to your thoughts and I was hoping to be one of those persons that could do these things and be an inspiration and all those things but this is going to be one yet another video that will go on and on and on and you'll have to follow me on these bumpy and side tracks and whatever from the very beginning Imogen Heap. I started to watch her vlogs and that's amazing. She offers so much from herself. She she shares her life and, and I don't even expect her to respond. I show my support, watch all her vlogs and I don't mind. She can say that I do rec I do notice you and I thank you, you helped me and this is kinda of my saying that in the future now, hopefully, I'll manage to continue to make things because that is a really good thing for me to do when I'm in lack of any other kind of inspiration because every, every person needs inspiration throughout life. And when I'm in the lack of inspiration, it really helps to just sit down by the computer and deal with all the problems that may give me because this is not a good friend at all and I don't even want a new computer I don't want to spend money on new programs or anything so I just deal with the fact that I've got this computer I've got a very old version of Windows Movie Maker and I'll just do the best I can with what I've got because it's just a hobby and, I, and of course, there's nothing would please me more than to know that I'd be an inspiration, a muse, or whatever. 
if I manage to do something that even if only one person enjoys what I do, that's enough. But I just don't know if I'll. I don't expect to get response from all the people I leave comments, and I don't expect everyone to notice what I say or do or anything. I can imagine that every kind, every word matters, and. It, as I've said in another video in this channel that it's strange how one bad comment can kill all the good ones and I, to be honest I haven't got that many bad comments I've been blessed and I, hopefully that will continue <laughs> but, I can't, but when I think about it now and when I put it in words that pretty much is kind of Increasing the danger of getting those comments that I don't want. Why can't people be kind, be nice? And if you don't like a video, leave it be. And if you don't, if you're not a happy person, you don't have to share that. But rather go find happy persons and try to let it come up on you. Because that's what I would want from people that watch my stuff, that if I have something that's good, I will. I was actually just going to say, I just plugged in this camera to say that I don't know what I can promise. I don't know. I don't know who I am. I don't know what I'm going to do. I know that I've got an apartment that I need to empty so I won't be tied back from taking a leave or something. I, um, I don't know why but I've always been drawn towards England. I don't know if I'll get there any day. I don't know what I'm going to do there. I don't know how? I don't know. When? I don't know. The answer most likely is 42. <laughs> Recently I've been guided through the galaxy and one of the characters got sunglasses that kind of shields you from fear. <laughs> Won't be very beneficial though because when they turn black you don't see much and that could get kind of... but I love the idea <laughs> so much be behind every word uh, but now these, these days I can hardly even concentrate on reading <laughs> this video my words are not a complaint or something I don't know what else to do I've been thinking about blogging for my own sake if that could help, because uh, many people, at least once in their life, try to write a journal, and I've done that several times since I've been... I've tried to go back to do that, but uh, it just ends up me lying in bed and writing and writing and writing, and as always, always end up being the reason why I don't continue to do that. Anyway, mm -hmm. it might be that I'll continue to make a video every now and then and post it and hopefully someone will enjoy watching what I make or do or say or write and those of you who will settle with that are probably the ones that I'll appreciate to have as a view. I can't continue this path that I'm being led on where I kind of not only get manic about me and my abilities and what I have to offer and what what I manage to do or we all all p people want to make a difference we want to have something to show for we want to anyways I've always promised myself not to let any other person's actions 
get to me, no matter what it is, and if no matter if they misunderstood me or if anything, because that's my problem. If I let it get to me, and I don't, I don't intend to give myself even more problems than I've got.